Alright guys, today I want to talk about ratchet straps. No, I'm not talking about these cheap pieces of junk. What I want to talk about is the, are these new uh, quick loader ratchet straps. Now, quick loader sent me these to try and I'm really glad they did because, to be quite honest with you, I thought they were gimmicky. I thought they were going to be cheap because I've used a bunch of cheap ratchet straps. I'm really glad they sent them to me because I've been able to try them, test them out, use them. And uh, I'm actually really impressed with them. I love tools, uh, things like this, especially functional tools that are, have been improved upon. So ratchet straps have been around forever, but these are actually uh, a really good innovation. Nice big handles, and then they have uh, a spring inside the spool. If it pulls that on, pull it out. But, you know, I've tried to get it to bind. My main concern was that I had about, about it getting twisted feeding back in and then this becoming just a knotted mess. Um, I mean, you twist it and even if it does twist a little bit, it just comes right back out. I'll show you a couple of examples and um, uh, do a, a couple tests. So if you do any amount of hauling or have to strap stuff down back of your truck or whatever, you're probably like me and you've just got wads of mess of straps, right? Uh, I say every time that I uh, put these up that I'm gonna put them away neatly, but you know, I'm not even trying here. This is, this is real. This is what it's like every time I, I go in my box. It's my fault. I should put them back neater, but I just don't. And then you've got bags and, and knots wadded on of a mess like this so that's what really makes these handy when you're done with them they retract back into themselves you can put them in the box and they're stored nice and neatly i can't wait to replace this mess with more and more of these so that i don't have to deal with this every single time Hey Siri, call for help. Ha 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 ha, are you kidding me? Is this real life? Look at you, hanging in those straps like a big idiot. Hey, Siri, take a picture of this idiot. Nope. Okay. That may have been a bit of an over-dramatization. But, point is, regular straps are pain in the butt. They're a mess. And they can be frustrating because they're just aggravating. Let me show you. How easy this, these are. Pull it out, put it on the loop, pull yourself back tight, come over the load, put in our ring, tensions itself, ratchet it down, close it. I'll show you a couple other examples of uh, the straps in use. It's important to keep your frosty beverage container strapped down and safe, right? So let's do that. So I'm over here at my open trailer. I've got this sawhorse here to simulate a load because I don't have anything in it right now. This is what happens when you're using these big straps or even the, the S straps to try to strap down a load when you're trying to go up and over. Super frustrating, you almost need two people. Sometimes it's just it's just really hard. So, and then as you're trying to line everything up, right? Let's go. Finally get it pulled and then, and then nothing. So now we're gonna use the uh, quick loader. We'll do the same test. Everything lined up, doesn't matter because it's spring loaded. Hook my hook. Take it off. And it's done. Now, these larger straps 
have this really cool feature with this D-ring. Maybe you're in a situation where you know, you're trying to wrap around something where you don't have a hook where you can get this maybe a round top bar or something like that. So you come around, loop into your D-ring, and then pull tight. And then strap your load down. All right, guys, so I just wanted to show you guys a, a quick demo of, of how these quick loader straps work. Quick loader hasn't asked me to make this video or, or post anything. They did send me some to try. Um, and again, I'm glad they did. I've been pretty impressed. So my plan is to get rid of that hodgepodge of all different sizes of the standard type ratchet straps uh, and go up to these. Um, I don't have all the model numbers, but go to uh, Quick Loader's website. I'll put a link down below and look at the sizes they have. They have all the way from your standard, uh, you know, 500 pound uh, load capacity all the way up to 10,000 pound load capacity straps. So. Um, you know, they're going to be more expensive than a standard strap, but uh, in my opinion, you know, you take this 12, this is a 15 foot strap, you throw it in your box and you pull it out when you need it. It's not a big mess, knotted mess. Uh, it works every time you need it to work. So go check them out. I appreciate you guys watching. See you next time. Being funny? What? Being funny? You're gonna hang yourself! I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm fine. I just, I need to admit it though, cause I'm not done. I'm not gonna hang myself. When you're finished, I'm gonna explain to you how dumb this is. What? Are you filming yourself right now? Yes, I'm gonna edit it. It's gonna all be edited in like five seconds. You're sweating. It's hot. It's outside. I'm in a trailer. <laughs>